Hey everyone, Mark here from Now You Know. Today's video is all about the latest Toyota vehicles and their key fobs and the special features that they have in them. Some of the features you may not even know about. Now key fobs are nothing new. They've existed for a couple of decades and generally in the past the key fob was used to unlock and lock your vehicle. But the latest key fobs do a lot more than that. Along with sensors in your vehicles, you can simply keep your key fob in your pocket without having to press any buttons walk up to your vehicle and with the sensor around the handle you can unlock your vehicle you can even start your vehicle while your key fob is in your pocket which is a pretty amazing thing when you are at the end of your trip of course you get out of your vehicle sensor on the side of the handle you can now lock your vehicle now i'm sure you'll agree that these features are pretty cool and convenient but have you ever considered what's going on the whole time you have your key fob in your pocket? Or for that matter, when you drive home at the end of the day and you come inside the front door, you put your keys on a hook or maybe you toss them into a bowl, what's going on with your key fob then? Well, your key fob is actually constantly emitting a signal trying to communicate to your Toyota vehicle. Now, you may be thinking to yourself, does that leave my vehicle at risk? Well, yes it does actually. If your keys are in close proximity to your vehicle, they're constantly communicating back and forth. Now, a car thief can actually drive around the neighborhood, spot late model vehicles, and they can actually use software on a computer to try to boost that signal, capture that signal, and transfer it onto a blank key fob, making it easy for them to get into your vehicle and to drive away with it. Now, the other thing about your key fob too is that since it's constantly emitting a signal, it's always using the battery. So I'm gonna show you a little technique, a little, uh, instruction on this key fob where you can actually press a combination of buttons to not only disable the key fob to save battery life but also to stop it 100 percent from emitting the signal so that no potential car theft can capture that signal now on this 2019 toyota corolla hatchback i can lock the door in two ways there's a sensor on the handle which locks the door or i could hit the top button on the key fob but as we discussed this key fob is still consistently setting out a signal. I can put these keys in my pocket, grab the handle, the sensor in the handle allows me to open up the door. So this vehicle is not 100% secure. Okay. So let's try this again. We'll close the door there. I can lock it either by touching the sensor or by hitting the top button on the key fob. But one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to disable this key fob entirely. And the way I do that is I'll press the top button, that's, that is the lock button, and then I'll hit the unlock button just below it twice. The key fob will show me a two flashes and then two more flashes. Now I can put this in my pocket or put this in my home. Even in myself, if I walk up to the, the uh, car and I have the keys in my pocket, I can't open the door. I can't even start this vehicle. I can't do that until I pull my key fob out and I press any of the buttons on the key fob. Now I walk up to the vehicle back in business. So I'm just going to show you one more time. You'll hold the top button, which is the lock button, followed by two presses of the unlock button. It'll do four flashes, do one, two, three, four, and this vehicle is 100% secure. Well, I hope you've enjoyed today's video, and if you've learned something new today, why not give us a like and subscribe? That'll let us know this is the type of content you'd like to see. Anyway, y'all have a great day. Bye for now.